Hey there guys. <clears throat> hey YouTube. So today we're talking about something kind of different. Um, it's a very, very simple KVM. Now KVM stands for Keyboard Video Mouse. Um, and what that does is uh, normally you would share one monitor or two monitors, so on and so forth, uh, and a keyboard and a mouse with two different computers. So you'd have two, maybe a laptop and a desktop. You'd hit the button on the KVM and the monitor, keyboard, and mouse would now be um, being used by one, let's say computer A, hit the button. Now the keyboard and the mouse are used by computer B and not computer A, and the monitor will switch over to computer B as well. Um, what I need this for is during, with my current setup right now, I've got my laptop and its monitor, and my desktop, my ultra widescreen monitor, and the other is a standard 1080p monitor connected to my desktop, which is underneath my desk. So what I needed was something that I can connect my USB, um, my, my USB keyboard and mouse, and my, my keyboard is wireless as well, so I'm hoping that I can just connect the wireless um, receiver into one USB port, my standard mouse, my gaming mouse from uh, World of War, my World of Warcraft gaming mouse by uh, uh, SteelSeries. I'm going to connect those babies up and uh, see if it all works. Now the way you do it is there's going to be a little button that you put somewhere on your desk. You hit the button and it switches between the two. So let's get to unboxing. So theoretically, this should be a very, very simple device. Just a USB input. Um, it looks like it doesn't come with any kind of, any kind of installation, so it should be really simple. It's, it's basically a switch. All right, so we've got our we've got our user guide, which we shouldn't really need to be honest. Now this is the primary KVM box. You can see the lights on there. It's going to show you if you're connected to computer one or two. You got your VGA input, which we're not going to be utilizing, and then two USB ports. Let's undo this cable here. Now this is only a nineteen dollar product. So even if it's not super, you know, super awesome and blows our mind for $19, you know, it should get the job done. So now what you have here is these are the inputs for the both computers. So you're going to connect this one to one computer, this one to the other. We're not going to be using the videos, by the way. And then you're going to run this up to your desktop, just right next to your keyboard and mouse. That way you hit the button and it switches between the two. And then we'll go ahead and plug our mouse and keyboard into this and see how it works out. So I'm gonna go ahead and look like an idiot here and uh, crawl under everything and speed this up for you guys so we can kind of get this done fast. So now, you can see that I'm moving stuff around. My monitor's being weird, but that's not because of this, I promise. Move stuff around here. Now we're using the laptop. Now we wanna go over to these screens. We just reach over, hit the button. Now we're using the mouse and keyboard on this screen. So now we're able to do things, move it back and forth between the two. Let's test the keyboard. Keyboard does not seem to be working. That may be due to the fact that it's wireless. Let's try switching it back over because I know it works on the other laptop. It also may be the wrong receiver, so let's try a different receiver real fast. Oh, wrong receiver, guys. So it's working there now. It's working there now. So it looks like we're good to go. Um, 
Hopefully you don't make fun of me too much for my <laughs> trying to route everything around. I just need to get two USB extensions um, to make this go a little bit further so I can wrap it around and not have it so cluttered and messy. Um, until next time, guys. Thanks for stopping by.